Lord Singh of Wimbledon. My Lord, an ill-conceived campaign to confine Sikh teachings open to all to a single ethnicity is being led by an extremist fringe group, the Sikh Federation, who reject key Sikh teachings. Their unlike, un-Sikh-like argument is that being recorded under ethnicity will get us more resources than other religions. They also play on the hurt felt by many of us over the 1984 genocide of Sikhs, saying that reducing the religion to an ethnic group will help us get a Sikh state in India. They base their arguments on a misunderstanding of the Mandla case in the early 80s, in which I was an expert witness. The law then protected ethnicity, but not religion, against discrimination. The law lords ruled that as most Sikhs then in the UK were born in Punjab and had Punjabi ethnicity, Sikhs were also entitled to protection. The criteria of birth and origin would not be met today as most Sikhs are born in the UK, nor is such a convoluted protection necessary. The 2010 Equalities Act gives full protection to religion. The politically motivated federation falsely claim mass support with questionable statistics. The ethnicity argument was discussed at a large Gudwara in Hounslow in front of ONS officials and firmly rejected, yet the federation include Hounslow amongst its supporters. My lords, many Sikhs and people of other faiths are appalled at the way that some politicians anxious for votes are willing to trample on the religious sensitivities of others and accept as fact absurdities of those who shout the loudest. I urge that we look to what re different religion, religious groups actually do for the well-being of their followers and wider society. Lord Naseby.